Hello my friends, my name is Cozy, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. Now I will go ahead and tell you, just uh, for transparency, I did replay this game because I knew there was kind of a lot to it, and I know there's para death. So I went and replayed the game up to this point. I have not died yet. I know last time, well one, I fell off the balance beam in the beginning, and two, uh, I died once, I believe, to Valraven. Now I'm on a clean slate, and I'm fresh, okay? So, zero deaths. And also, if you haven't seen the previous two episodes, I would highly encourage you to go watch them, because replaying this game, it made me realize how good this game is, and I'm really, really enjoying it. So I highly encourage you to go do that. Uh, if not, play the game for yourself. But this is where we left off last time. I am brushed up with the story, killed Valraven, and now we are on our way to Surtur. Who is the fire giant, of course. Whoopsie. To my lands. I knew enough of their tongue to beg for mercy, and they took me as a slave. I wish now that they had slaughtered me like the others. And I rode their storm of fire, death, and slavery to many lands. This darkness you speak of? <laughs> I know it well. And I'm still here to fight it. Yeah, Druth is a real one. Uh, a lot of really interesting stuff went into this game, uh, you know, between the research. I was doing a little bit of looking into what the developers, like, what they did. Uh, obviously, there's a warning before you start this game about mentions of psychosis and dealing with psychosis quite a bit. Or at least bring it to life in such a way that a player can experience it and a character that is well fleshed out. Again, interesting read, even if you're not reading the plot summary, if you're trying to play this game, there shouldn't be any spoilers. But at least on, like, the Wikipedia page, uh, just in terms of the game development, if you look under that section, a lot of good stuff went in there. Uh, oh, here we go. These fucking dudes. Whoopsie. Whoa! Okay, you step off. I do not... Damn it. You can't really... Oh, fuck him. Bollocks in this, quite bad, huh? Damn it. Yeah, this is a great way to start. <laughs> Maybe talk to. Okay, y'all are backing me into a corner a little bit. Okay, then. Wow, that was one death. Right back to where we were. Good to know. Alright, that was my bad. I fumbled the combat. I swear I haven't died up to this point somehow. I don't know how the... F well, I do know how the fuck that happened, but... These shield dudes are a pain in the ass, but I seem to have... Kinda sorta figured out... Uh-oh. I think if you... God damn it. There we go. You gotta melee him to open up the shields. Bro, please don't tell me I'm about to die twice, like, immediately. Uh-oh, I'm down bad. If I could just focus on one of these guys at a time, that would be swell. Okay, thank you. Alright, duly noted. Oh my god. Okay, this is... Not what I needed. Two of these big boys. So priority one is not getting backed into a corner. Now, the shield guy kind of requires a bit of focus. So if at all possible... I would like to take out these other fucking dudes. Whoa, almost fumbled that key. Fuck this dude. Please get out of here. Bro, oh my god, can y'all chill out? I can't deal with too many of you at a time, okay? Whoa, you suck, bro. Parry that. Heavy attack. Okay, I like them lined up like that. Because when they're lined up, they're easy to parry, okay? It's when they get... Around the sides of you, it makes tracking a little bit difficult. Oh, good job, Senua. Give me that body. Yes! 
That was delicious. Oh my god, we're gonna finish it up. Back up. Give me that body, sugar. Yes. Oh, fuck me. Uh, are there multiple? I can't tell. I don't exactly have a wide field of view. Something's telling me. Yep. Back up, back up. Okay. Damn it, I fumbled the key. Alright, I need to I need to back off of this dude. Did that change my focus? Back up, back up. Okay. One at a time, please. I've only got one sword now. Oh, eat it, big boy. Okay, I don't want to speak out of turn here. Oh, there it was. Wasn't paying attention. Oh, that was close. Damn it. Don't tell me that killed me. Come on, give me one more shot. Okay, please. Give me a little bit of space here, big cheese. I mean, shit. Okay, good. I'm trying to get out of this corner. Buddy is not letting me out. Please give me some fucking space. Well, not with that mindset. Damn it, boy. Man, did that kill me? Okay. <sighs> For fuck's sake. Okay, give me a second here. I'm about to screw this whole run up. The problem is, okay, I'm not criticizing the combat. I like the combat, but I am trying to, there's an attack pat, fuck it, I'll be right back. It's nearly over, finish it. Hell yeah, interrupted that shit. Interrupted that shit, okay. Not to bitch about the uh, combat. I like the combat, it's just a lot sometimes, okay? Um, so with the shield guys, and this wasn't so much an issue, uh, in the first half, because if you've seen it, you know, um, there are no shield guys in the first half or third of the game, depending on how this stuff shakes out. But with the shield guys, you have to melee them to get them to throw their shield off. I think when I first played this, like, oopsie, like a year ago, I didn't re like, I thought the point was to try and break their shield. I didn't realize until now that a melee attack will break their shield block. So if you Oh, excuse me, if you chain together heavy attacks, light attacks, and then you throw in a good melee in there, like a good punch or kick, that'll get them to continue to stumble their shields, so that makes life a little bit easier. Know that only a sacrifice will stoke the fires of Muspel and let the dead walk through. Oh? Find the fire, Senua, to follow the path to Surt. Oh, okay. Also, of good note, I didn't realize this, when you're at low health, you aren't as good at combat, you can't chain things together as well, but you will heal over time, you just have to not take damage. I thought it was pretty much you had one health bar for the whole fight, or like the whole encounter. Uh, that, okay, hold on, maybe I gotta, oh, there it is. Oh, okay. Fucking run for my life, I guess. Excuse me, boys. Damn it, my mouse keeps going out of bounds. I don't mean for it to. Hell will not give you the answers you want. But you mustn't look away from the horrors it does offer. Because you cannot overcome suffering if you refuse to look at it. What an animated guy. I like Truth a lot. I wish he was my companion on this. Okay, so... What's happening? Where's the fire gone? Where's it gone? The fire yep. It was everywhere. The fire. Sert. Sert is through there. Sert's through here? How will 
she get through? I know, I know, I know I can't get through. I'm just saying. I feel like I could climb over that. But you know what? Maybe I'm not ready. I know, I know. Damn, I thought we were done with the whole illusion thing. We were done with Valraven, but I guess not. Which is unfortunate. Because I prefer a more straightforward fighting method. You know what I'm saying? The Northmen say that the defender of Muspel is called Surt. The foremost of the fire giants. His name means the Black One, because he is like something burnt. The Northmen believe that he sits at the border of Muspel with his flaming sword, and at the end of the world he will leave his post. He will travel to Asgard and Midgard, waging war against all the gods. He will be victorious. I forgot that fades out if we're not near it. Yeah, so it's like I said the first time I was playing this, I'm really interested to see how they're going to do Surt, because Surt is a fire giant. Valraven is just like, okay, he's a raven in man form, that type of thing. That's one thing, but and I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in my first video. You've got Valraven, which I believe is um, sort of like an entity of the dead. You know, okay, that's cool. And then the game, it's like, that's half of it. The other half uh, is the destroyer of the whole universe. So quite the... Quite the uh, change in pace. Yeah, I know. I'm just... <laughs> now I'm paranoid, man. Those shield guys are a pain in the ass. Find the fire, Senua, to follow the path to Surt. And I died, I think, three times there. I made it the whole game without dying once, and I died three times. Not even in a boss fight. It's too far. She'll never find it. She'll never make her way back. She oh. needs to remember Everything will burn. Concentrate, concentrate on where you're going. She needs to remember the path. Everything will burn, then how will she find the way back? <laughs> oh, interesting. She won't be able to tell. Um, something's telling me that, uh, it's gonna be a bit of a challenge to get back. So, uh, okay, I'll be just talking about the path itself. I hope you don't actually mean I need to have this memorized, because I'm not very good with that. I'm assuming that it means I'm going to have to... Well, no, the path fucking ends there, too. Hold on. Ooh, shit, what's over here? Secrets, or is like this the way I'm supposed to go? Okay, I'm going to get to the point. Maybe we can do it the opposite direction before I actually focus on it. See if I can trace it back the other way. The Northmen made fire sacrifices, burning slaves like me to reveal the path to Surt. I searched for meaning in their suffering, in their eyes. But they just screamed like helpless pigs. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. All right. Well, I mean, I'm no genius here but okay so if this is the thing and i'm gonna come out of here right oh I, I should probably not focus on that before i'm ready i come out here it's looking like it's looking like this whole path is going to be burned which is weird because there's a drop down right here so i would think i'd come back this way but i'm a little bit confused because the last time there were like walls around the fires that i could trace to find my way back I mean, if that's, uh, if that was misleading me, then, oh, well, let's see, you don't happen to provide me with an, oh, they kind of do provide me with an overview, but I can't really make heads or tails of it, because even if, like, some of these spots that I can see are clear of the fire area, it looks like there's a fire, like, right there in the middle of the screen that's going to be cutting through that, and I was seeing that all throughout the path coming up here anyway so fuck it we're just gonna see if we can make it what's a little bit more darkness eh oh we're toasted damn it my fucking mouse is going out of bounds okay well Druth is telling me this way. I tend to trust that man. It's 
straight out. Oopsie. Well. <laughs> some sometimes it's just that easy, you know what I'm saying? Ow! Damn, what the fuck? Excuse me. Ah. Do your gods answer your prayers, Senua? I asked the gods for mercy, all of them, even theirs. None answered. In the end, I set myself free. Defy the gods, Senua! Find your own path, like I find mine! My gods abandoned me! I am alone. Damn, bro, that whole board fell on my head. Senua's got that thick skull. Okay, well, you know, for all the sake of planning and all that stuff, that was not that bad. This looks like an arena to me. Am I right or am I right? I don't know. Let's hear a story first. I like these. The Northmen believe that the world will be destroyed someday. Mm -hmm. They call it Ragnarok, the destiny of the gods. Asgard will be attacked by Surt and the fire giants. A monstrous wolf will swallow the sun, and the gods will fight in vain against their enemies. There is nothing they can do to prevent it, but Odin ever seeks knowledge and magic, hoping, hoping to find a way to postpone that dark day. That looks like a rune. The R rune, uh, Raido, I believe. Um, okay, well this all looks very inviting. So there's the gate, or the fire gate, and then there's one of these bad boys as well. We chill, you're not gonna spawn one of those shield guys here. Man, and the fight against Valraven, you know, thankfully they split it up. Oh my god, am I gonna have to run through all of this? In the fight against Valraven, they split it up to where Valraven would attack you and then... Uh, it would spawn in some normal dudes for you to fight, and then it'd go back and forth like that. Okay, well, I know a way through the house now. Um, but man, even so, like, I can't believe how difficult that fight was. I mean, I guess it wasn't super difficult once you learn the mechanics. There is a drawback, of course, to going the first half of the game without... Dying or hardly even taking damage. So, not to flex or anything, but... Like I, like I said, I didn't know that you would regen health throughout a fight. And stuff like that. Certainly with the shield guy, you know. Now, I do respect the lack of direction the game gives you. Oh, that's why that looked like an R. The devourers. Insatiable gods of darkness. I come from Eren, Senua, where I once followed my own gods, the Tuatha de Danann. Why did you abandon your gods? Senua, I was a man of knowledge, not a warrior. To survive, I did things. Bad things. Like you, Senua. The man I once was has died. And when that happens, even gods you worship can die with you. They wanted to let him have his peace. Boom! Baby knew that was there. Where we even got to the fucking puzzle. Uh, and I saw this rune, so I believe this is the Dagaz rune. Back over this way. Or, I didn't see it, but I saw the little emblems for it. So, it's around here somewhere. Uh, uh, there she is. Hell yeah, it gave me that one. That was pretty generous. Okay. Man, like I said, um... <laughs> you're, you're expecting game a lot of pre-prep from me that I am just not ready to provide to you. Ugh. Now the question is... Are we gonna have to fight Hela? You know... Which, I would assume we would. I don't see a reason why not. Especially when you clearly segment the game into two parts. Like, fight Valraven, fight Surtur. 
and then that opens the gates to Hella. Like, I'm pretty sure we're gonna fight her, so. Um, I mean, like, yeah, you know, I want to prep and all, but I don't really know what the purpose is. And it's kind of hard to follow, which again, you know, I respect that the game uh, doesn't want to hold your hand. Like the whole shield guy with the, well, the shield guy, like it, nothing tells you that a melee will break his block. You know, if you're not accustomed to using the melee, you're not trying, I mean, you only have three attacks, admittedly, melee, light attack, heavy attack with the sword. So it's not like too complicated, but if you don't do that experimenting on your own, then there's just no way you would know. And you would essentially just be boned the whole time you're fighting one of those uh, shield guys because you wouldn't know what to do, which is what would have happened to me if I'd have continued playing this game. So, I mean, it looks like just a straight shot because the other way there was a lot of fire and embers. This way, not so much. Uh, coming over here. I mean, the R is here. But... I mean, hopefully that's not on fire. I mean, if that's on fire, I'm boned because of the, or I guess I'll just have to blitz through it. All right, fuck it. Might as well. I mean, it. again, I try not to be too overconfident. It just, it looks like a straight shot. Because obviously, like, you see some embers there and some embers up there. But going this way, there's a lot more embers. Even cutting through this little path over here to the right. Big embers, big embers. So, I'm gonna... I'm going to go with my strategy of simplest is best. We'll see if we can more or less just make a straight shot there. All right, touch him on the nose, Sanoa. See if I was right. Bonk. Nice roll. Pat that shit out. Oh, mouse went out of bounds again. Oh, well, okay, it's leading me... Not that way, so... Whoops, no, 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 definitely keep running. Okay, not that way then. Can I... Can I go through this? Show can't. Okay, send a, Yeah, don't get stuck on that stuff. I'm not gonna die, chill. Senua is not a fan of the whole running thing right now. I mean, if it was me, I would definitely be crawling my way across this board. I feel like that would be faster. But, there we go. Sweet. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. You'll panic too much. Jeez. Okay. So my strategy was not correct. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ugh. Punch him, stab him, heavy attack. What do you think I'm trying to do? Oh my god, yep, there they are. Damn it. Pair, or dodge that way, there we go. Got one of them, shit. Ah, oh, yeah. I love this combo. Dude, get the hell out of my arena, bro. Okay, now that we're done with that little aside. Excuse me, dead guy. Ah, fresh air. You say your world has collapsed. Mm hmm. Good. Let it collapse and have the courage to shed your tears. Raise your world to the prime. My world is dead. Only then, as with a newborn, will you see the world anew. No, I see nothing now. Damn. Okay, well, and sticking with my 30 minute per episode thing, uh, I'm all out of time for this one. So thank you very much for tuning in. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, thank you all. Like I said, um, for waiting, I'm really happy to be back with Senua Saga. I think it's a fantastic story. I'm sorry I didn't finish it before, but I'm also kind of glad that I didn't because it allowed me to come back to it. And the second time through, I think I'm learning a lot more. I care for the story a lot more. And overall, I'm just having a fantastic time. And I hope you all too. Don't hope you all are too. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps me out. I really appreciate all of you. And I will see you next time.